Germany's parliament has passed new immigration reforms that would make it easier for skilled workers to come from abroad to work. Experts say Germany has a massive shortage of skilled workers and needs hundreds of thousands more each year to fill the gaps. The new law eases the requirements workers currently need to meet to migrate to Germany. It also makes it easier for workers to bring their families and to apply for long-term residence here. Now, the government needs over 2.2 million people to move to Germany. Here is everything you need to know. Let's get more on that from Herbert Brücker from the Institute for Employment Research here in Germany. He's focused on migration and international labor studies. Now, many European countries are now competing for skilled workers. Does this law change make Germany a more attractive option? Yeah, we hope so. Um, the law uh, has several key innovations. One is in the past, we had the obligation that your skill level has to be proved that all your degrees are similar to those in Germany. And you may circumvent that now if you have achieved a certain income threshold level. That is one major thing. And the other one is that job seekers can come to Germany via a so-called chance card point system that you can arrive to Germany and seek jobs that are improvements but I'm a bit concerned uh, that that is sufficient that we get an additional 100 or 200 skilled workers which we urgently need in Germany. Mm. Now this law addresses skilled migration. Migration and labor migration. So the focus of the law is on labor migration and on the other hand, Germany, together with the European Union, has increased hurdles for, hurdle for humanitarian migration. But there are one or two aspects in the law which make it easier for humanitarian migrants to work in Germany, that you may also change your track if you have a certain skill level and if you perform skilled jobs, you can move away from the asylum system to the regular uh, labor migration channel that is an improvement but will not alter dramatically uh, the situation for humanitarian migrants in Germany. Mm. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Mary Oladipo here and I'm going nowhere. On this channel, I talk about faith, motherhood, lifestyle and more. If this is your first time of seeing this face of this channel at all, thank you for deciding to stop by to watch my video. And if you're a returning subscriber, well, thank you. God bless you. So please hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And if you have, Thank you. Okay, so today I come bearing good news. Now, let's talk immigration. So sometime last month in June, the German parliament um, passed the law and introduced Germany Opportunity Card for job seekers, which is quite different from the existing um, job seeker visa. Now, the German Opportunity Card is a new type of work visa for non-Europeans that like third world countries that allows them to come into Germany without a job offer for one year. This opportunity card is also known as green card or chance card. So um, this visa has like a lot of flexibility and long-term stay for an individual in Germany. Now the government needs over 2.2 million people to move to Germany. Here is everything you need to know about it. Now, what is an opportunity card? An opportunity card is a new regulated way of attracting skilled workers from non-EU countries to Germany. Now, back in September 2022, the German government announced the plan to like launch a new way of attracting international talent, good people, skilled workers into Germany and coined the term opportunity card. That is chance to cut in German. Now, this opportunity card is based on point system and you need only six points to get the opportunity card and you will be allowed to come and search for work in Germany. Now, did you get what I said? You're not going to have to need a job to come over. You would come over and look for a job. Now, there are different things that helps you to get to six points. They actually need 14 points, but you have six points you qualify. So on this card, you need to come to Germany without having a job offer in advance 
and you can stay for one year as i said earlier to look for job opportunities in germany due to shortage of skilled workers in germany so who are skilled workers a skilled worker is an individual who possesses a high level of expertise, knowledge and proficiency in specific field or occupation or a training. So what are the type of skilled workers that Jamie is looking to have? Electricians, software developers, nurses, graphic designers, plumbers. These are just examples. So talking about plumbers, if you know a plumber in your home country, please tell them to get ready to apply for opportunity card because this is going to be a life-changing job for them i assure you now if i am not sure of all that um skilled work that will be allowed to come in i am certain about plumbers now one time we had water leaking from our bathroom and we needed a plumber to come work it out for us it took almost four weeks almost four weeks that is almost a month before we finally got a plumber to come fix the problem we had. So we had to like live with it for up to four months. And this has nothing to do with the German brokerage system. It's just because they have shortage of plumbers here in Germany. So hurry and apply. What are you waiting for? Now, when can you start applying? Now, the visa is yet to be implemented, um, but the bill has already been passed and it is going to be publicly opened um, and effective from March 2024. Now, how is this point base going to work? It's going to be six um, points for you to get to opportunity um, for you to get to apply for this opportunity card. Now, this opportunity card is based on points. And the points is going to just be like that of Australia, New Zealand, Canada. But you need six points to be eligible. Now, what are the criteria for this opportunity card? To be eligible for opportunity card, you must satisfy three amongst four conditions I'm going to meet. You have to be under 35 years. You have to have finished um, to, um, university. You have to have experience of at least three years of your skilled work and learn JAMA to an extent. So what are the benefits? Now, the benefits of having this opportunity card is you can travel with your family as dependents to Germany. They can move over with you. You can stay for as long as one year in Germany. You are also allowed to do part-time jobs pending when you find a permanent job. Now, who can apply for this opportunity card? Anybody can apply. So long as you meet the requirements, you can apply. So if you already have a university degree, you already have a point so you're good to go so i believe this initiative from the german government is good news for all those who are willing to migrate and work in germany so i will be dropping videos more videos on steps on um application how to apply where to apply if you have not subscribed to my channel please hit that subscribe button for more sponsored jobs moving over to germany how to move over to germany for free and how to move over to germany without a job hit that notification bell so that when i drop the videos you get notified all right with that being said i'll see you guys in my next video god bless you stay blessed bye Money, I want, I want to hear what the people, the people, they call, they care.